Let's dive into the bluefin tuna. If you're new here, I'm all things marine. Go ahead and click that subscribe button if you love the ocean as much as I do. And make sure you smash that notification bell as well so you don't miss out on any of the weird ocean creatures that I talk about. The bluefin tuna is one of the fastest fish in the world, reaching up to 40 miles an hour underwater. They are very large, growing up to almost a ton in weight and up to 15 feet long. They eat smaller fishes and invertebrates and they feed by swallowing the prey entirely in one gulp. There's no chewing involved. As many of you know, they are very sought after by fishermen because they can be worth several thousand dollars if the fish is large enough. The main predators of this fish are killer whales and pelagic sharks. However, these fish are generally considered to be at the top of the food chain, also known as apex predators. These fish have the unique ability to adjust the temperature of their body to still be higher than the water they are surrounded by. This process is carried out by a structure known as a countercurrent exchanger. Much like sharks, they need to be moving at all times and they swim with their mouths open to maximize oxygen flow. They are very heavily fished and this is partially because of the large demand for seafood. Bluefin tuna eggs are able to hatch within two days of becoming fertilized, which is a very short time. But perhaps the reason why they have such a short time in the eggs is because the longer you are in an egg, the more vulnerable you become. The shorter time that you are inside of that egg, the more likely you will survive. Unfortunately, this fish is decreasing in population size and is not considered endangered yet, therefore there is no restrictions on fishing for them. Also, fun fact, they are very hard fish to reel in if you do hook one. In fact, in Nova Scotia, it took six men 62 hours to finally get an 800 pound one in their boat. I hope you all enjoyed this video. Thank you guys for watching All Things Marine.